Yesterday, after finding out this world record attempt was going ahead, we made a quick video about if we think Jakob Ingebrigtsen could break this world record. So here's a brief reminder of the history of the world record and how close Jakob Ingebrigtsen has been in the past. Tefera charged towards the line and stops the clock in 3.31.04, taking 0.4 seconds off the previous record set by Hicham El Garouge in 1997. So although this world record is three years old, the previous mark stood for 22 years before that, held by the middle distance go Hicham El Garouge. Last year, Jakob averaged 56.48 per 400 meters, so we are talking about fractions faster than his previous performance. And to show how close Jakob was, here's a visualization of how far he was behind the world record last year, which is 5.6 meters. That brings us today. And obviously, if you are watching this video, Jakob Ingebrigtsen did break the world record. This is his first senior world record, adding to the 19 age group world records he already has. Before we break down the splits, here is Jakob discussing with his pacemaker what pace the wave lights will be going at in the race. Yeah, 3390. 56. 40 40 40 28 Okay, so it's quicker than. A bit quicker. Yeah, that's uh, <laughs> one second quicker. And for everyone who says wave lights are the reason we're breaking world records and they help so much, again, Jakob got within five meters last year whilst running solo. So he was more than capable of breaking this world record regardless of this perfect pacing wave lights. So to break down the splits of that race, that is 28.08 every lap, which is 200 meters. 56.16 per 400 meters and 800 in 152 and for the americans out there it is the equivalent to a 345.9 mile we do apologize that there's no footage or photos of this race yet it has just happened and we aren't allowed to show footage because a certain company we shall not name will copyright strike us if we do so so apologies again you can blame them let us know your thoughts on what world record you think Jakob will challenge next now he has his first senior world record